Miami, it's like a lot of people were stuck on Poison Clan, home team. You know, of course, you know, Luke had all that locked down. But me younger, I was always in the East Coast music. And I'll say, you know, as far as him, Eric B and Rock him, you know what I'm saying, for president, that kind of opened my eyes real young to be like, man, these cats put words together, like, that's like some power, man. But what really got me, and I followed them for a long time to this day, and I, I keep saying it, but I always be Nas, you know what I'm saying? And then just hearing his first album and all that, Illmatic, at his age, uh, I followed him from that point, man. It's, he was from the streets, you know what I'm saying? Clean cut dude, street poet, man. He, he let you know what it is. You know what I'm saying? That, that really inspired me. Being where I came from and what I seen. So, you know, from now, man, as he grown, it's like, it made me keen of longevity of doing music, man. That you could go always go back and like listen to a record and it take you to a certain time. Man. So nothing never watered down, man. Straight raw, real hip hop, man. And that's from the streets. You gonna have your category of gangster music and all that, but like real raw hip hop is all that. You know what I'm saying? So that's what that chronic and sound you're gonna bring, man. You're trying to bring that classic back. You know, these days we in the digital days, so. You know, it's about downloads and things of that nature, but I just want people to have that feeling of going to buy an album, you know, like it was when you were younger, so. that be a real, real milestone for me if I can do that, man. And I won't even say if, it'll be done. Wow, how now?